Welcome, and for now is a Xiaomi Redmi 8A and today I'll show you how to transfer files from your phone to an SD card or vice versa. And to get started we will want to open up the um, or is it called on this device, let's find it. The files up, I assume. There we go, file manager in this case. So file manager, let's allow whatever it pops up with. Let's cancel this. And now you wanna go to the folder icon right over here. And you should see it looks like by default it goes to the internal storage, but you can tap on a drop down and also go to the SD card. Now before we go anywhere, I'll give you a brief overview where you can find everything. So starting off, DCIM folder will contain photos and videos that you have captured with the device as you can see right here. Then you have downloads folder which will contain anything that you have downloaded either through your web browser or emails. Anything downloaded will be in this folder. Uh, then these folders are, I believe, created by apps um, like Me Video Global, probably the one that well, uh, Xiaomi includes. Then you have movies, music, uh, files usually are they're placed by the user, so you most likely know that something is in there. And then you have uh, pictures, which will contain screenshots, uh, although in this case it's empty. And that's about it. Um, rest rest of the folders are just uh, made by apps or um, well, if you place something in there, uh, like I said, you will pro most likely know that they're in there. And same file structure usually is located on the SD card. So as you can see, a little bit less folders, but also you have the Android, uh, you have the DCIM folder and whatever other folders we need to create like screenshots or stuff like that, it would just do the correct structure. So you'd find it also in here. So from here, let's find the files that we want to transfer, which for me, like I said, I'm going to use some uh, photos. Um, and from here, you want to just simply select them and you do it by tapping on that circle right here. So as you can see, that becomes selected and you can either select all of them if you want to by tapping right here. As you can see now all of them are selected uh, or by simply just tapping on it, uh, whichever ones you want. If you don't want all of them, you would probably want to select uh, the specific ones that you don't want and also another way you can do it is just select the entire folder by holding it like so and once you have selected whatever you want which I'm gonna go and just select a couple of these uh, once you select well, anything basically it gives you these options on the bottom so you have move and when you tap on uh, more you should see copy right here so select whichever one you want, either move or copy. Uh, move will completely remove the files from where they are right now and move them to a new location while copy will duplicate them basically. So I'm gonna go with move. And once you tap on one of the options, it will bring up uh, folders where you can move them. So right now we're on the internal storage. So I'm gonna go to the SD card just to keep it a little bit different. And from here you can drop it anywhere you like. So you can drop it right here, go to the DCIM if you want to. Uh, or you can also create a new folder. I believe if you tap on more, create folder. So you could create a new folder and drop it into that if you want to. I'm not gonna really bother with that. I'm just gonna paste it right here. And there we go. As you can see, there are the five photos that I have selected. So the same process will work for any kind of other file and that is how you would copy them or move. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.